Today's the day. We're here and uh, we just walked in, so I still have to get dressed. So it's 6.30 in the morning and the kids are at home with my parents. I'm so glad that they're here to help us with that. But um, let me go get ready if you have anything See, to say. there's no reason to be all worked up. She's, she was telling me on the way up, how can you be so calm and talk about other things? And I'm just like, I don't know. I mean, there's nothing to get worked up about. We're just going to go in there and we're going to start doing everything. So. so we've been here like just an hour and everything has been started. The IV, which hurts really bad. The labs, blood pressure, and they started Pitocin. <laughs> and I already felt my first contraction. So I'm up off the bed because it's... I, my butt was already numb, so I just need to get up and bounce, dance. <laughs> so, okay, so the reason okay. why I'm getting induced is because the baby was measuring small, and um, he's measuring at like 12%, and so, or percentile, and so that's very small. We're thinking he's not getting everything he needs to inside of me, so... Yeah, he's got to come out and... I think it's all I'm, hogwash. And it's, I'm 39 weeks and 6 days, so just a day before my due date. So, there goes another one. It's not bad yet, so <laughs> we're okay still. <laughs> She's still smiling. <laughs> It's been, let's see, it's been like 40 minutes. It's 8.05. And they're coming. There is one. There's two right there. So I'm just getting done with one. Like, I, like you see, I'm talking, so it's nothing too painful right now. They're just uncomfortable. So, which I think I was having some of these yesterday. It's nine o'clock and they just broke my water and which was kind of different because every time they've broken my water before it's like a explosion everywhere and this time it wasn't and like not much was coming out like I even stood up for them to put more absorbent things down there and um, nothing was coming out and then with the next contraction everything a lot of it came out it felt so weird like I was peeing myself and was making me laugh so more of it was coming out <laughs> but the, the fluid was clear which is a good sign so right it's when it gets like what yellow it's not good I don't know what color but if like there's yellow. like meconium or they just don't want to see any of that baby poop in the water so now we kind of just wait and see if that breaking of the water is going to help me out a little more before they bump up the Pitocin. So, <laughs> I just can't believe this is happening. Like, I wasn't expecting to go into labor for another like week and a half on my own, you know? And so the fact that I'm getting induced and so... <laughs> I'm just sitting here. Oh, there's more water coming out. Maybe I'm getting another one. Yeah, it's coming. It's coming. Yeah. They're making me laugh right now. It hurts. <laughs> but it's better than screaming. It's 10.55 and they have the Pitocin up to a 10 now. And it's, it's getting pretty serious. So, um, did I tell them that my, they broke my water? I don't know. I'm getting one right now. Just keep going. Is it like, like the feeling where you like really gotta pee? No. Oh. 
<laughs> I don't I have no idea what that would ever feel like. <laughs> I don't have that body. Twelve nineteen. Twelve nineteen, and I just got checked, and I'm, I'm only a five, and oh, it's really bad. You can see how often the contractions are happening. You okay? Do you need anything else? Came out kind of quick. Did I tear? I'm gonna look here, okay? okay. So you're gonna feel me touch. He's just hanging out. He's well, amazingly mm -hmm. he's now. Oh, yay. Yeah. Tiny little skid marks here. And that needs stitches. He looks like your wife. Look at his face. Yeah. He's grabbing her. Look. <laughs> hey, you grab her. <laughs> He's strong already. Yeah. Oh, yeah. he's pink. pink and pretty. Isn't he pretty? Yeah. Yes. I said his face looks like mom. But I think he's yeah. yeah his little boobs coming down too. And then maybe he does look like mom. Right. Perfect. Come right here. You can grab onto me. Is that all you've got? A skid mark? Everyone ready? Seven five. Oh. You got that towel now. You're He's grabbing. He's a grabber. <laughs> yeah. Which makes the measurement still 13. Yeah. Yeah. Look at those lips. Yeah. Sharp strip on the back. His his head wasn't uh, combed. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
His head wasn't like pointing from pushing him out. Oh my goodness, honey. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no fun. Oh. That's good touch mom. I'm sure you are. I'm just trying to... Hey, bud. What's your name? Are you going to tell us? We're in our recovery room. And he is just so precious. He's just perfect, guys. And he passed his hearing test just a little bit ago, so me and him are just hanging out while Daddy, I think he's on his way to get the kids and run a few errands and so they get to meet him and by the way his name is Casey Allen Campbell <laughs> I love it I love him he's so cute he's perfect he came out really fast um, it was it was kinda ugly but I pushed him out because I did not want to feel any pain anymore, but he came out. I mean, his head wasn't even combed or anything because of how fast he came out. But oh, those noises are so cute. Yeah, it's kind of dark in here, but I just want to keep it like that. I'm gonna lay down for a little bit while the kids aren't here yet and just relax. We just were brought in here, so um, yeah, this is the recovery room, so I'm just gonna relax and I'll show you guys when the kids get here. The red one. Yeah. They're here to see the baby. Who is it? That's the baby. Baby brother. Yeah. Here, let me pick the baby up so they can. He was in mommy's tummy. You remember my big belly? He was in here and he's out now. Want to give him a kiss? Yeah. How did they do oh, it? I have to poop him out. Okay. Mommy, I, I Be careful, Arya. You, you Arya, no, no. The, the, uh -huh. the doctor. Arya, yeah, the doctor helped Stay me. Look, look at the baby. Casey. Want to give him a kiss? Her, are you doing okay? So we've been visiting as a family for the first time, but they got to go. You guys are going to go home and behave, okay? Bye bye. Be good. Yeah, put the chairs away. I miss you too, chiquita. Okay, just a quick, a quick recap of what happened today. Um, I came in uh, at 6.30 and by 7.30 the Pitocin had already started and um, they broke my water at like 8.30.
which I thought was too early because I was only dilated to a 2 at 8.30. And um, pains started getting really bad and I finally had the baby at 1.45. Um, I was actually at an 8 and I was like, I'm feeling pressure. And she was kind of, the doctor was here, like she, I pretty much labored with her here. And she was kind of feeling me as I was contracting, it was so hard. And um, there, she said there was just a little lip of cervix still in the area where it shouldn't be. And so once I started pushing, she kind of pushed it away. And so we're able to push him out and he came out really fast and uh, like his head wasn't coned or anything. He was, it was rough, huh? That was, that was kind of rough. Anyway, he's right here. But he's, I, he's the one I've had the earliest ever. I was 39 weeks and six days. So just the day before the due date. And he weighed seven pounds even, or seven pound, seven pounds, 0 0.5 ounces. So it's just seven pounds. So he's he's little. Our girls were bigger because they just came after the forty weeks. So um, yeah, he's our little boy. He's perfect. Um, we like his name, Casey Allen, and he's just a perfect little boy. He did nurse very good. Um, an hour after he was born and. I'm trying to get him to eat again. It's 7 o'clock right now. The family came and went, and I think Cameron's going to come back after putting the kids in bed. We'll see. But I think that's pretty much it. I don't, I'm not going to make like a birth, birth story or anything like that, but because we only vlog. But it was, it was kind of a crazy day. I don't know if I want to do that again because I didn't get an epidural. So, um,. I wanted one, but I was like, no, I'm almost there. We can just get through it. And Cameron w was very scared too, but we're very happy now. He's here. He's so beautiful. I feel fantastic. I can breathe again. I'm going to sleep on my stomach tonight, that's for sure. And um, it's been such a blessing to be able to have babies and to hold them in my arms after being in my stomach so long but thank you so much for watching everybody I hope you enjoyed I don't I'm, I'm not sure what we got on video and if I'm gonna show it so um, I'm just grateful that you guys watched all the way to the end and keep keep watching because we're gonna see Casey grow and it's gonna be fun just like all the other kids I just cut his nails because you scratched yourself already. Don't poke your eyes. No, no poking at your eyes. That's not allowed. Oh, you're poking at your eye again. Sometimes he looks like his brother Derek. Sometimes he looks like both sisters. Yeah. Yeah. All our kids look the same, I feel like. It's a really cute hat. There's, they're donated hats for newborns. Yeah, it's keeping you warm. I didn't even make you one. You okay? Don't scratch. Don't scratch. Yeah. Are you waving at them? Say bye-bye. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. <laughs>